welcome to the next vlog here in Canada where we have snow. This is my favorite weather of all time. I love it when it snows. Just on my way back to the studio now. I'm gonna warm up a little bit and then we are going to start another time lapse edit. And uh, I will start this vlog once I get back in front of my computer. For now, I'm just gonna enjoy this nice snowy weather before, you know, global warming takes it all away. Okay, guys and gals, here we are. Here we are in the warmth of the studio in front of the computer, and ironically enough, we're gonna be editing a photo of a beautiful model on a sunny beach. Well, it wasn't sunny anymore when I shot this. The sun had just sort of hidden behind some clouds low on the horizon, so we got this beautiful, beautiful diffused light. But <laughs> here we are in a nice, warm, tropical place. You know, we can dream. Um, so this is Rochelle Wild, Playboy cover model, and uh, I had the pleasure of working with her down in the Dominican Republic a few years ago, and uh, we shot this, and uh, I really love this series. It's going to be published in a future issue of VX2 magazine, uh, probably volume 2, issue 3, issue 4, somewhere around there. It hasn't been decided yet, but uh, it will be published in the magazine for sure if you want to see these photos uncensored. So, why was I in the Dominican Republic with all these models? I'm glad you asked. Well, here's the thing. A couple years ago, a photographer here in Toronto used to host these uh, these events, and he would invite a bunch of photographers, a bunch of models, makeup artists, stylists, and we'd all go to a tropical location, and we'd shoot for a week and have a blast, and it was a lot of fun. And uh, he stopped doing that, which is unfortunate, because it was a lot of fun. Um, but, but uh, what I want to do is once I build up my online community through this vlog and social media and all that stuff, what I want to do is start hosting my own little tropical getaways for photographers and models and makeup artists, hairstylists and all that stuff. I mean, why not? We work hard all year. Why don't we all get together and take a vacation for a week, go someplace nice and just relax, shoot some photos, get some great quality shots and then get them published and just, you know, do what we do and enjoy it in a nice setting. So. That's something that's on the horizon, depending on how fast I can build up my online community and you know all you internet friends, um, we'll see. Okay, I'll be back to talk about the photo settings and all that fun stuff in a bit. For now, enjoy this track and I will be back. Give me neon lights, don't be paper highs 
There's a human in your heart of hearts. Hiding two colors made you fall. Okay, okay, I'm back. Let's start with the uh, photo informationals. So, this was shot with a 5D Mark III. Uh, EF 70 to 200 f 2.8 LIS and one two hundredth of a second f 6.3 ISO 1250 and I did have a flash or speed light on the camera and it was set to a probably minus one power and I just used it as a little fill flash to fill in all the shadows on the model so those are the settings there and special thanks to Andy who was my assistant on this trip she was my assistant and stylist and uh, this is a photo I shot of her at sunset on another day BAM yeah lucky to have an assistant who's also a stunning model and this is one of my favorite shots uh, but I'll talk about this shot in another vlog now back to Rochelle yeah, and Rochelle, she's one of my favoriteest people of all time in the modeling industry. I met her actually the year before I shot this photo in Mexico. We were on another one of these tropical shoots and uh, she was one of the models at this event and we clicked like right away and uh, became instant friends and got some great shots in Mexico. And then uh, we met up again here in Dominican Republic and shot some amazing shots again. And she's just one of those really genuinely awesome people, like great character, great vibe. And uh, I love working with her. She's totally fun. And as of right now, the only other vlog that has Rochelle Wilde in it is Vlog 59. We caught up recently and had a little late lunch and, uh, you know, shot the breeze and caught up. And it was so much fun to see her again. And her life is sort of taking her in a different direction. And there's certain things in my life which are taking me in a different direction. And we're both kind of going in the same direction. So, uh, with that being said, there will be a lot more Rochelle in these future vlogs. Uh, we're going to get together and do some fun stuff. I'm not going to talk about what we're going to do because I don't want to spoil it right now. But, uh, yeah, she's going to be appearing in a lot more vlogs so get ready for that all right so here is the image polished off and finished and as you can see I flipped it horizontally so Rochelle is facing in the opposite direction and there's a reason why I did that subconsciously in the human mind here in North America where we read left to right when we look at an image a painting you know a scene whatever the case may be we also perceive that from left to right so in this situation right now you're looking at the ocean and then you're looking at Rochelle so what that does is it creates a bit of a story so it's like here's an ocean here's the model this is the scene this is what's happening and creates a bit of a story but I'm gonna reverse it here so you can see it and in this situation what you're seeing is you look at Rochelle you see her body you know, it's like she's all hot okay this is sexy and then the ocean is kind of like an afterthought and you're like okay whatever it doesn't matter you're looking at her so the story isn't as deep as when you flip it around and now you can see here look at it again your eye goes left to right you see ocean you see the body you see Rochelle and then now there's a little more oomph to the image so that's why I flipped it around horizontally and for photographers out there I mean that's just something to think about when you compose images and edit images and do all that fun stuff uh, try and put a little bit of the story into the photo through the composition so yeah there you go all right, ladies and gentlemen of the internet, that brings this vlog to a conclusion. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Hopefully you learned a little something and hopefully you're looking forward to seeing more Rochelle in more vlogs. Um, if you want to get a hold of me, if you want to book a shoot, check out www.thephoto.ca. If you like this vlog and want to see more like this, please give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate the like. And uh, that's it. Thank you for watching. Peace out and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Hiding true colors made you fall apart